guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Holly. Today I'm gonna to be planning the week of Christmas in my personal planner. And the kit I'm gonna be using is this Little Miss Papery, uh, I forget what she called this, but it's, oh, maybe Winter Wonderland. Um, it's like this really pretty soft pastel Christmas kit. I just loved this. I think it's so, so pretty. So I have the base um, two page vertical kit. I also picked up the horizontal full boxes because I like those for the personal because they're a little bit shorter and it comes with a bunch of quarter boxes at the bottom. And then I also have, um, oh, I also picked up the date cover, so that'll be good. And then I also have three <laughs> um, oops sheets that go along with this kit because Brittany made a few mistakes over the course of the fall season with some of my orders and she always sends these when she like fixes whatever went wrong. She also sends this on top of that because she's amazing. So I definitely am going to hit these up as well for some extras. So I'm gonna pop out my inserts and get started. And so I think I am going to skip doing any washi down the middle just because I don't I feel like there's a lot of deco in this kit and I'd rather use the deco than adding washi and because I didn't get the personal kit, I don't have one that goes along with this spread specifically. So I'm just gonna do this, um, or I'm just gonna skip that. So in the top left here, I'm doing my weekly ombre that had uh, for my, I think, I'll, I think I'll use that for my uploads instead of my meals just because I'm only gonna really be here Monday through Thursday and it's probably gonna be kind of like a a little bit of a random <laughs> week in terms of food as well, just trying to clean out the fridge and everything. So next up, I want to uh, put, on Monday, I want to put a workout in. So I'm gonna take one of the quarter boxes for that. And I have my Lexi Kylie Design sampler sheet here. I'm gonna grab this little pink sneaker for that workout. And then I'm gonna take a full box. I'll take the glitter one. I did get these in matte, by the way. I find the matte paper, it's definitely not as vibrant, but it's a lot easier to work with on the So Much Crafting paper. So hopefully I don't have to get out like the undo every other second to work with it. And then I'm going to take on top of that a half box and mark down. Ooh, actually I'm gonna use, I wanna work on YouTube that night. Oh, but this is glitter. I don't wanna do glitter on glitter. I guess I'll take the half box instead. But I'll take this one over here. And I will take one of the little laptops that comes with the kit to put there. Just to mark down that I wanna get a lot of YouTube done. Actually, she has a bigger one over here. I think I'm gonna do that because this one looked a little tiny. So we'll put this in, perfect. Oh yeah, that's a lot better. And that's really it for Monday. And then on to Tuesday, I'm gonna work out again in the morning. So I'm just gonna take another quarter box. And I'm gonna take a more decorative full box here because I don't quite know what I'm doing on Tuesday night yet. Uh, I feel like I should put something down. Maybe I'll put a me time sticker down because why not? Okay, that is cute for Tuesday. And then on Wednesday, I'm going to work out. Oh, I need an icon for this. This is, I'm gonna try and go for a run. So I have my Scribble Prince Co. running icons here and I think maybe this could work, this color. Yeah, that's fine. And then on to Wednesday, I am working out again in the morning. I really, I'm probably, I'm trying to work out Monday through Thursday in the morning because I know I won't work out while I'm traveling over the weekend. But realistically, I might skip one of these, but I do like to just have them down um, so that I can decide if I want to do it or not. Oh, and I did have a bill due on Tuesday and I wanted to change how that is, um, what am I trying to say? I wanted to change how that, which card it comes from. So I got a new credit card. So anyway, I'm gonna take this bill due and put that here is my point. Perfect, okay, now back to Wednesday. I 
need to do some final wrapping time. So I think I'm going to take a daily chore sticker since these are cute and I'll just put it on maybe like a plainer background. Then I also should do some laundry because I need to pack the next night. I think in my Erin Condren I marked down that I'm just going to do laundry on um, Thursday, but that really doesn't make sense because I need to get it done before I pack. So I should do it. Any needed laundry needs to happen on Wednesday night. So I'm going to take this. I don't like the purple next to the purple, so let's pick a different color. Here is this. Put this down here. Layer the laundry day over that. That looks very cute. And then we'll put the daily chore in the middle here to mark down that I need to do that gift wrapping. And then this class is going to be like a dumbbell style class. So I'm going to grab a purple Lexi Kylie Designs dumbbell here. Put that. Perfect. And then on Thursday, Thursday morning, I'm going to put in one more workout. Again, knowing myself and that I probably won't do all these, but you know, we got to be aspirational here. And for that workout, I'm going to take a planner-esque sneaker icon. So I'm going to try and go up to a spin class, put that there. I think that color goes well enough. And then Thursday, I definitely need to get a lot of packing done. And then I also wanted to get some kind of pre-filming done. And for packing, I have these super cute caress press stickers. I think this purple and teal one will go pretty well. So I'm going to grab this and put it on maybe a label sticker here. Maybe I'll just put it on a flag. And then I'm going to take a half box and mark down that I want to get some YouTube done. And I will take a little planner because I am going to be doing some pre-planning. So given that, I think I'm actually going to take a planner half box. Ooh, let me see if this pulls up. Oh, here we go. And I'm going to take a planer half box just because I don't like to use a print on a print. I think it looks a little distracting. So I will take this half box here, put this planner like that. And then maybe also she has a cute little camera down here. I'll take that as well on the little mistakes sheet. Really cute. And then on Friday, we're going to be traveling all day. So what I want to do is make myself just a little don't forget list um, of stuff that I definitely need to remember to bring. So I'm going to take, uh, I'll take a green checklist and I'm just going to cut it down to maybe four. Just like as a, like a last minute, you know, check this before you leave the house kind of list. And then she does have on her little sampler here. She has a really cute little don't forget. So I want to layer that maybe over a piece of washi. So let's do it like this. It looks really cute. And then I want to mark down that we're like driving all day. So to do that, I will take, maybe I'll take this printed half box here. It's like slightly. Oh no, it fits. And then I kind of cut off the little point there, but that's fine. And I'm going to take her little car sticker and maybe also the, I'll take this here. Yeah, I think that's good. And then on to Saturday. So Saturday we will be um, in my, at my mom's house. And that morning we have a brunch. So I'm going to take a little glitter and I'm going to take a full box since it is Christmas Eve I do kind of want to label it Christmas Eve somehow maybe I'll take this glitter up there and label Christmas Eve for that and Oh, maybe I'll add some deco there. I'll come back to that. And then I do need to label that brunch. So I will take another quarter box over here and just mark that down. 
And for that, I'm going to use, she has a coffee cup. I'll use the little coffee cup because it is a brunch. I think that's cute. And then that night we go to dinner and then to midnight mass. So I'm just going to take some cute little asterisks that are on here to mark down the two things. And that's good. And then of course, Sunday is Christmas. So I'm going to take this. It's the most wonderful time of the year. I think I'm going to take this, but then I do want to obviously do something that says Merry Christmas on it. So I have leftover from my uh, two little bees kit. She has some cute little script ones that say Merry Christmas. So I'm going to take in a half box and just put those there. And that's, I don't really feel like, I don't need to really plan out what we're doing. I know what we're doing and it, it will just kind of be hanging out with family. So take this and maybe just an exclamation point because that's cute. Very cute. Oh, I wanted to leave room for the weekend banner. Oh shoot. Maybe I'll save it. Oh well. I have a ton of weekend banners too because there's some on this thing. There's one over here. Hmm. Maybe we can shift everything down. No, it's fine. I do want to use the date covers though, so I'm going to do that next. And I will use, I think I'm going to use these ones because I think these could go with like another wintry kit, but this is pretty Christmas specific. So I'm going to put the dates down first. And then I'm just going to go ahead and lay these down. Okay, and those look really cute. And next I do want to add just a little bit of deco up there. I think I'll take this little Christmas, actually I'll take the ornament one up here, put that there, and then maybe also the balloons that came with the kit. These glitter balloons are cute. And then I'll take the hello as well. Just because I think that's like a cute way to use that. Okay, I think that's it for the main spread. Next, I wanna do my grid bar, of course. I don't need it as much this week, although I guess I'm working Monday through Thursday, so I'll wanna have this with me. So first up, I'm gonna take this Winter Wonder, do I want the Winter Wonderland? Is there one that's like more Christmassy? Winter State of Mind, a snowflake is a winter spot. No, I'll take the Winter Wonderland one. Put this up here. And then I'm going to do a to-do list that will be for work. She doesn't have like a sticker that says work, but I'll just know. And I will take this blue one to match. And I think I'll just take this little laptop since it's already kind of lifting anyway to kind of mark that it's for work. Cute. And then down here, oh, I did want to do the habit. I'll just stick the habit. Maybe I'll just put the habit on like a background of printed washi so it doesn't look so boring with all the blue. And then I'm going to make a little list of to buy. Because I have a few last minute things to pick up. Hopefully there's four. Yeah, I think I can fit four. Okay, there we go. We fit four. And... Then I um, on the back, I'm going to take another full box here. I'll just take this Winter State of Mind one because it's cute. Actually, I'll put it in the middle. I'm going to do a, basically I need like a, a to-do to list that I can take with me when I'm going. This will be more for like YouTube and stuff because I am going to bring this personal planner with me when we travel. So this will be kind of like the stuff I, any editing or anything I want to get done while I'm away. So I will, because even, you know, even though it's like obviously the holidays I'll, and I'll be spending most of my time with family, you still have downtime at night. And I don't mind working on that stuff a little. 
So that is there. Put this here. I am gonna do a little to-go list just for anything last minute, like any last minute errands I need to run. I don't know that I'll need it, but I'll have it if I do. Cute, and then at the bottom, I'm just gonna put some washi, just cause I don't really have anything else I need to list here. So I'll just put these in and that's good. Okay, very cute. I, I'm gonna take this little planner and put this up here because these are like my YouTube tasks just to add like a little bit of deco too. And I can write next, eh, it's hard to write like that, let's see. If we can move this, I don't wanna cover up the hole. I might just punch out the hole. I'm gonna do that. Yeah, I think you still get the idea. Okay, so now I wanna do any deco left over. Um, I think I have several little ornaments like these. So I'm gonna intersperse these kind of along. Ooh, I could do the thing where you have your, uh, who does this? I think Helen from the Coffee Monsters Co. does this. She like goes like this. I don't know if these pieces of deco are big enough to do that though. So I'm not gonna do that, I lied. I lied guys, okay. I will put this big one over here. And there are some on this sheet as well. Okay, I kind of did that little deco thing. I think that looks pretty cute. Let me do that a couple more times. I have a lot of deco on these little freebie sheets. Okay guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and fill this out and I'll come back and share the final look with you. Okay guys, so here's everything filled in that I know so far. I still need to plan out my YouTube stuff for the week and fill in my grid bar, uh, but the plans are pretty much filled in. Let me just pop this out to show you guys actually. I think this looks super cute and decorative, a lot of fun and I am really excited to use this during Christmas week. I just think it's really pretty. And if you're wondering if I change the setup of my personal planner to match this spread, I absolutely did. And I will link a video that went up earlier this week below about my two different kind of Christmas planner setups that I did for this planner. I just think it's fun to kind of like be festive and crafty for the holidays. Let me show you what I have left from this kit. So I do have another week's worth of date covers. Like I said, those could possibly go with like a more wintry kit. So I'll hang on to those. I have some stuff left here from the base kit. And a lot of these, I think like, especially like the, the pink glitter, the purple glitter, um, anything that doesn't have the ornament print in the background could definitely go with other spreads. Um, you know, cause I think those are versatile colors that come up a lot. So I will hang on to all of these. And then the full boxes, unfortunately I couldn't use them all, but that's okay. And then with the oops samplers, still have a lot left on these, but again, like a pink glitter laptop I could use in a lot of different spreads. Same with the date night, paydays, all of these. So I will hang on to these as well. Really cute kit, really happy. I decided to use this during Christmas week. So yeah, that is it for this video. Let me know what you thought below or what kit you are using in your personal planner for Christmas week. I always love hearing from you guys. And give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe if you want to see more. I will be posting over the holiday. Just might be slightly different schedule than usual. And I hope if you celebrate Christmas, you have a great holiday. And if you don't, I hope you enjoy the long weekend. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll be back soon with another video. Bye.